next guest is just seven years old and has left audiences in absolute stitches. JJ Pantano recently conquered the Champions Edition of America's Got Talent, leaving none of the judges unscathed. Heidi, uh -oh. my mum told me that you're Victoria's Secret supermodel. <laughs> and she showed me one of your videos. But then Dad came home from work and we watched all your videos. <laughs> Simon, I did find out that you want to be, like, cryogenically frozen when you die. Yes. Looking at your face now, I think you started the process already. <laughs> Sick burn, bro. Fine size comedian joins us now in the studio. Welcome to JJ. Hey, JJ. Hey, JJ. Congratulations, young man. It's competing as a champion at your age. Do you do you get worried that you, you when you go out on stage and you have these big big people like Simon Cowell and Heidi Klum? Does that make you nervous, or you have no fear? Um, so I actually don't normally get nervous roasting, mm -hmm. but with Simon he actually got a little bit nervous because like he's the big big buff of the show. That's true. And if and if he gives you like a red buff or anything like that, you know you're not going through to the semi final. Yeah. Oh. So it's kinda of like when you I, wanna be well, good to the boss, but also you yeah. need to do your job. Yeah, exactly. Well he didn't look nervous. You nailed it. Yeah. Yeah. But when he actually did get through to the semi-final, mm -hmm. Simon and um, Howie Mandel actually put me through. So That's true. And Howie's a good sure. comedian. He knows what he's talking about. Yeah, he knows what he's talking That's about. That's right. Either. Well, you're very comfortable there sitting in that chair. And you actually took on our jobs hosting a talk show with some of those judges. So how was that, JJ? Um, so, yeah, what happened is when the super fans eliminated me, they realised they made a mistake. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course they made a mistake. Yeah. So, um, they asked me back in the results show to do a interviewing segment with the judges. I love that. Now, you've been doing stand-up since you were five years old. Yeah. What, what do you love about comedy so much and do you have any comedy heroes? Um, so, with comedy, I, I really just love being able to make people laugh. Mm -hmm. And with roasting comedy... Because so it's like, cruel or roasting, yeah, isn't it? it's cruel. It's, it's cruel. nasty comedy. So, yeah, but with roasting comedy, that like, I actually hit them every time because they never expect it. That's it. They never expect it because, like, they're like, what could he get me for here? Like, they're trying to think about it. And then they get them and they're like... Okay. Do you have any comedy heroes that do that sort of thing? Um, Howie Mandel. Yep. <laughs> awesome. They're going to say Don Rickles, but... But you seem so sweet, so, you know, it's always a bit of a surprise. But you've just released your new single. It's called yeah. They Just Don't Get It. And you're talking about you know, those boring, annoying parents, aren't you? I, my favourite line is, they kill the Wi-Fi when we don't eat our greens. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how, how was that filming a song? And, and how do you feel about... Oh, bless a, you. Oh, bless you. Uh -oh. <laughs> about being a music star as well now. Oh, we've oh got, God, always oh, God. Always oh, God. Oh, God, we've just... Well, I'll give you that and... There you go. No, no, go ahead. There you go. That's it. Well done. Yeah. But, yeah, you're a rap star now too, huh? Yeah. Do we, yes. do we take that thing? Oh, What's the song about? <laughs> Tell us. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going to put that? Um, there you go. Yeah. Tell us about the song. <laughs> yeah, right. Come on, this is your chance right. to plug okay. it. So, um, yes, you can get my song on Spotify and, <laughs> and on YouTube <laughs> at JJ Pantano. Uh -huh. And then um, what you can also do is, well, I actually had a lot of fun with my with my song um doing the film clip with it and everything and you guys are gonna need to listen to it. Oh right, we are all right JJ you're here to roast people. Can you can you do us? Can you roast us? Um well Belinda yes, I only JJ. I only roast celebrities. So uh, <laughs> oh, oh my god oh my god, god. Oh, you're gonna need these no, no. you're gonna need that. I'm okay with that JJ oh my no. god <laughs> okay, JJ. Well, I hope I make up for that. How, what, what have we got? So, David. Yeah. I heard you have an OAM. 
Yeah, sure. What's that stand for? I don't know. Old ageing musician? <laughs> oh, 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 you are good, oh, you are good. Oh, I'm sweating now. <laughs> I'm sweating. Well, look good on you, young man. Uh, with some good uh, burns. I like you. Thank you. Thank uh, you for get having that, me on the show. My pleasure. Get that sneeze scene too. You're welcome any time, even though you're you know, a good roaster. <laughs> yeah. And, and this... even though I'm not a celebrity. Oh. Do you feel bad? Oh. You don't feel bad, do you? That's, your, that's his I, job. I want to be a celebrity. That's his job, Mr. Slammer. All right, JJ, we love you, man. Good to have you on All the right. show.